Alrighty guys, we got a good, good, juicy movie review for you guys today. Today we're reviewing the brand new Puss in Boots, The Last Wish movie, and oh my god, this movie is so damn good, so damn beautiful, so damn amazing. I literally can't believe I just watched it, and I, I want to watch it again. I might get up out of my seat right now to go watch it again, because I like it that much much. So I just want to start out by saying Antonio Banderas plays an amazing part in this movie, playing Puss in Boots, obviously the main role of this film. If you guys don't know who Antonio Banderas is, oh my god, what is wrong with you? You guys need to go watch his movies, he's, he's amazing. The voice acting was spot on by everybody, I really, really enjoyed it. Salem Hayek, I think I pronounced that right, as well as Florence Pugh are in this film as well, they did an amazing job as well. But moving to the animation, I just want to start out by saying the animation of this film was so goddamn good. So goddamn good. It literally looked like Into the Spider-Verse, and I just love that kind of animation to films. I think this is my favorite animated film of 2022. Honestly, it is that damn good. The music was spot on. The colors were so vibrant, so vivid, and so freaking gorgeous. Literally, every scene was just epic. 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 And honestly, it was pretty emotional. I, I, I got teary-eyed at one point. I can't lie. I can't lie. I did. I always do. I'm a big freaking baby when it comes to films. But I also had scenes where I was jumping off my seat and I was like, frick yeah, man. Let's go. Frick yeah. And oh my god, this might be the scariest animated film I've ever seen. So in the movie, there's parts where Puss in Boots gets chills in the back of his neck, like, you know, what cats do when cats' neck hairs start going up. And I'm dead serious when I say this, I was the exact same way. The wolf would be whistling and it would sound like a scene out of The Walking Dead when Negan starts whistling. It is damn scary. The villain arc was pretty good. There was a couple villains, but anti-villains, I guess. You could say Goldilocks was an anti-villain, um, but she was awesome. There was also a lot of Easter eggs, a lot, a lot of Easter eggs, man. I can't even name all the Easter eggs in the film because there's so many. There's just a lot of stuff for fairy tales, and obviously, I guess Puss in Boots slash Shrek is a fairy tale, but... There's a lot in this film, and it, it is great. They captured it perfectly, and the movie wasn't very long, so it was captive. I, I stayed engaged the entire time. I watched it, I tried to watch it last night, but it was at 12 o'clock in the morning, and I fell asleep. Uh, so I rewatched it this morning, and I just, I loved it. I loved every second of it. It was amazing, and I genuinely want to watch it again. Oh yeah, and guys, spoiler alert for this part, at the ending when they see Far, Far Away Land, I was up and freaking off my seat i was off the rails i was like i heard the shrek music and i was like let's go dude literally so awesome just just so freaking awesome you see Gingy, you see pinocchio you see all these characters but definitely the last easter egg with the far far away land leading into the next puss in boots slash shrek film i can't wait i really can't wait so if i'm gonna give this movie a rating out of 10 i'm honestly i'm, I'm gonna give it a good rating here i'm gonna give it a 9.478 out of 10. I think it was damn good. The music was amazing. The animation was perfect. The cast was awesome. Just everything was so captivating, so fun, so enjoyable with this animation. And I loved it. I really did. I loved it. And I hope you guys loved it too. If you guys did enjoy this movie review, make sure you guys hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel for some more juicy, juicy movie reviews as well as follow all my socials linked in the bio. If you guys want to see another movie review, let me know what I should watch. Let me know what I should review. I probably haven't seen it yet. I, I haven't seen a lot of movies. I've seen a lot of movies, but I haven't seen, you know, a lot of movies. Yeah, yeah, make makes sense. But I loved it. It was great. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next movie review slash reaction video. Peace.